Hello and welcome to the session. My name is Mansi and I'm going to help you with the following question. The question says a random survey of the number of children of various age groups playing in a park was found as follows. In the first column we have age in years and the second column we have number of children. Now we have to draw a histogram to represent the data above. Let us see the solution to this one. First of all what we notice here is that these intervals are not of equal length. For example here the length is 1. Here the class size is 1, here the class size is 2, it's 2, 3, 5 and 2. So we see that class size is not same in all the cases. So let us see what we are supposed to do in such kind of questions. We make a table like this. Then we write down the age in years. Like we had 1 to 2, 2 to 3, 3 to 5. 5 to 7, 7 to 10, 10 to 15, 15 to 17. Now let us write down the frequency that was given to us. That is, for the age group 1 to 2, it was 5, 3, 6, 12, 9, 10, 4. Now let us write down the width. This we get by subtracting the lower limit from the upper limit. So 2 minus 1 is 1. So the width would be 1. 3 minus 2 is 1. So width would be 1. 3, 5 minus 3 is 2. So width would be 2. Similarly for others. Now we find out the length of rectangle. So what we do now is we select a class interval with a minimum class size. For example in this case it would be 1. We see that the Minimum class size here is 1. Now the lengths of the rectangle are modified to be proportionate to the class size 1. Now we see that when width of the class size is 1, then the length of rectangle is 5. So when width will be 1 in this case, it will remain the same. But when we see, let us take 5. So when width of the class size is 5, then length of rectangle is 10. But when width of class size will be 1, then the length of rectangle will be 10 divided by 5 into 1 that is equal to 2. Now similarly we do it for other classes also. So for the first class we have 5 by 1 into 1, it remains 5. Similarly this remains 3. Now this becomes 6 by 2 into 1 that is equal to 3. This becomes 12 by 2 into 1 that is equal to 6. This is 9 by 3 into 1 that is equal to 3 and this one is 4 by 2 into 1 equal to 2. So this would be the new frequency with which we draw this graph. Here on the x-axis we have taken the age in years and on the y-axis we have taken the length of the rectangle. So now with this data let us draw a histogram now. So this is the required histogram. Here we see that when age in years is 1 to 2, then length of rectangle is 5. When it is 2 to 3, the length of rectangle is 3 and similarly for others. So I hope that you understood the question and enjoyed the session. Have a good day.